Um, I started playing soccer when I was five. Um, it was just like every kid, you know, was trying out sports, and I immediately fell in love with it. Um, I haven't missed a soccer season since. I've played every year till now. Uh, I love the team aspect and the constant movement on the field. It's just you're always moving, and it's a quick paced game. So I fell in love with it right away. Probably the biggest challenge for me, uh, especially in rosary soccer, was coming in as a freshman on varsity and having to earn my position on the team. It was really difficult for me in the beginning because I'm not. There's a lot of older girls, and the style is really different and quicker and bigger girls. And I feel like that was really difficult for me to get to where I am today. But it definitely has worked out. I've definitely become a leader on the team. And being a captain, it was a really big honor to get that this year. Because I started as a freshman on varsity, so I've been able to watch other captains lead the team and how maybe I sh what I should do, just to similar to them. Um, my style is more, I'm kind of a laid back person. I'm not like in your face, I'm quieter, but um, I get the point across and when there's something important that needs to happen, especially on the field, I'll make sure the team knows that. And I also think of myself as a mom on the team, like compared to the other captains, um, I feel like I, a lot of them can come and talk to me about a lot of things, not just soccer, but school-wise or maybe out of school. So that's the part I really enjoy too. A goal for me individually is to be a strong leader. As the, one of the co-captains, I feel like it's my job to lead the team. I would just want to be able to finish out my senior year strong and um, represent Rosary as best as I can as my last year. Um, as a team, I really hope we can advance to CIF this year. Last year was the first year um, we made it past the second round of CIF for Rosary and uh, history. So it was something I want to do again, especially like my senior year. It's I want to finish off strong and represent. A lesson that I've learned from soccer is teamwork, how to work with other people and how to handle different personalities and different ideas. I've also learned um, ownership for my actions and how if I must make a mistake on the field, it's not my it's not the whole team's fault, it's my fault and it's my job to fix my mistake and I feel like that's something I have to learn as I grow up too is maybe you'll make a mistake but just fix it and take ownership for what you do. Faith plays a big role in soccer for me. I've been Catholic my whole life and I've learned that put God first and at Rosary, Rosary we get to pray as a team together. We have a memorized prayer where we all say together that kind of helps us get ready for the game. So I know like in the tough time games or if I get hurt or maybe get upset with another player, like I have to remember God, what would God do and what would he tell me to stay calm and just enjoy the game and not get too worried about it. I'm probably going to miss the most representing Rosary. I'm really proud to be a part of the Rosary community and I think that's something that I'll really miss. I'll also miss the girls on the team. They're some of my best friends and it's going to be really hard saying goodbye to them, especially my sister. She's a sophomore, and we play together. And I've never had the chance to play with her before because of our age differences in clubs. So being able to play with her on the varsity level is something I'll really miss because I probably won't be able to do it again.